what is going on guys as it is obvious to see every single fifa video on youtube is about team the uh, team of season right now pack openings whatever but i just can't afford it so i'm going to do something a little bit different and these are the players as it stands will not be in fifa 18 so i'll start with carlos tevez who as we all know is the highest paid player in the world and is in china don't know what team he plays for can't be bothered to look it up but he's gone to china as you probably already know as okay in this team ha, oh, so as pato who i think will be missed on fifa oscar has vitzel igalo Adei, mikel anyone on the bench soriano's on china and so is hernanez so that's what the players that have gone to china out of the way i mean realistically i don't think anyone used oscar i don't think anyone used a no one used mikel so maybe igalo vitzel i mean pato probably will be missed by players of fifa but as it stands they're not going to be in fifa 18 um yeah not, not really much more to say on them lasana diara has also gone but he's gone to the i think he's gone to like an arabian league arabian dubai kind of like uae league but either way he is not going to be in fifa next year first retirement is martin di michaelis i mean He's like, what, 36? He's had a good career. City, Bayern Munich. He's got a very nice track list is what I'm saying. And, you know, he's he's done he's done well in his career. So, you know, fair play. Respect to Emma He He's just announced his retirement. And, you know, yeah, I mean, he's not going to be in the game. Neither is the legend Philip Lahm. I mean, we all know that this guy is still one of the best right backs in the world. He's 34. He's retiring a little bit early. But you know what he's achieved so much in his career a world cup probably a couple champions leagues i mean respect to Lam. he's done incredibly in his career as has alonso alonso thank you so much for the champions league 2005 i will always love you for that um and just everything you've done at liverpool you absolute legend i mean every so often you'll see this guy at a liverpool game on on tv he loves the club and we all love him. Thank you so much for everything, Alonso, and good luck to whatever you do in the future. I doubt you'll be watching this, but anyway, it's out there. Next, we have Guido Fofana, who unfortunately is being forced to retire at 25 due to a recurring ankle injury. That is really sad, to be honest. I mean, I hope he does well in the future. It's, it must be awful to, to, have, to have your career cut so young just because of an injury. I mean, honestly, that, that's bad. So, good luck to him. Vanden Boer has not retired, but he has gone to, I think, the Congolese League. Don't know where that's coming from, but, yeah, he's gone there. I mean, he's a four-star skilling right back, so I think some people end up missing him on this FIFA. Um, yeah, Hanano is the thing we covered. He's gone to China, as is Soriano. Lampard, we all know, has retired as well. Um, he did a lot in his career, so fair play to him. He is... He's a very good player, and I can assume that he's just going to be a world-class manager. Next, we have the legend, the man, the myth, Steven Gerrard. The best player ever to grace football. Not biased at all as a Liverpool fan, am I? I have his card. I could sell him for profit, but I am not... I There is no price which will, which will allow me to sell this guy. I'm sorry. I'm never selling him. He is in this club forever. Just Gerrard, I... As a Liverpool fan, you just can't sell him. I love him too much. He's done so much for us. He's our under-18s coach next year. So, I mean, same thing with Alonso. But he is Mr. Liverpool. Thank you for everything, Gerard. And on the, on the next note, we have Joey Barton, a.k.a. the most popular player in the whole of football. This idiot has played something like 1,400 bets that breach FA rules in like what is in his football career so he's been banned for two years he's effectively retiring given that he's like 33 already i mean realistically no one's gonna miss him i'm sorry joey but that is how it is and the last honorable mention is going to be roman eramenko you may remember him from from like previous fevers or maybe even this fifa his car has been took off an ultimate team but you may remember as what i'm saying and he is not gonna be in fifa 17 no fifa 18 or any other fifa probably because he tested positive for cocaine you idiot so yeah that is the end of the video if you did enjoy it please drop a like and i will see you guys later